Two bomb threats called into Cudahy High School in a matter of hours. Both were checked out. Both were deemed to be false alarms. But that doesn't mean they weren't disruptive and worrisome. Jason Calvi joining us live tonight with the online messages that led to the school sending the kids home. Jason? Hey, Ted, yeah, two days of threats, two different bomb searches right here, and two all clears here. The students are safe tonight. Police here in Cudahy say no one's been taken into custody yet, and they're not sure if it's one or multiple people behind these threats. Bomb sniffing dogs found no dangers here at Cudahy High School. The first threats reported Sunday. The Cudahy Police Department notified the school district about those threats around 1030 Sunday night. And that led to a major search. Cudahy Police partnering with Milwaukee Police as well as the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Department and the Milwaukee Bomb Squad. By 4 a.m. Monday, police gave the all clear. No threat. But then new threats came in. At 10 a.m., families started alerting school and district administrators that individual students were getting threats like this one. Get ready. It's set to blow in two hours. Cudahy High School shut down at 11 a.m. Police again searched the building. Once again, they and bomb sniffing dogs found no threats. The school district of Cudahy put out a statement saying these events have tied up community resources and have caused unnecessary angst for families, students and staff. And the school district says they are working with Cudahy police to quickly find the people or people, the person or people behind these threats and bring them to justice. Reporting live in Cudahy, Jason Calvi, Fox 6 News. All right, Jason, thank you.